In an introductory statistics class of 50 students, there are 11 freshmen, 19 sophomores, 14 juniors, and 6 seniors. One student is selected at random. In this example, we will try to identify the sample space, the space of the random variable, and we will try to illustrate the random variable itself. The first thing that we will identify is the sample space. In our lecture, the sample space are the possible outcomes of our experiment. And we usually denote it with the letter S. And the possible outcomes of these events are the following. We either get a freshman, a sophomore, a junior, or a senior. So this is now the sample space of the random variable. After identifying the possible outcome of this event, let's try to illustrate now the random variable. We will denote this random variable as x. And since we have four possible outcomes, we will try to assign numbers to each outcome. So for this case, I will use 1, 2, 3, and 4 to represent the outcomes freshman, sophomore, junior, and senior respectively. Again, these numbers are arbitrarily chosen. You can either choose 0, 1, 2, and 3 to represent the four outcomes respectively or any number that you can imagine. The reason for that is the outcomes doesn't represent any numerical value. And finally, let's try to identify the space of the random variable. And we usually denote that one as r sub x because x is our random variable. And the space r, 1, 2, 3, and 4. So these are the sample space, the space of the random variable, and the random variable itself. Thank you very much for watching and have a good day.